You ready? You ready? All right, so here we are back at the O2 Arena, London, England. We were not here when Leon Edwards confronted Jorge Masvidal backstage, the whole three-piece and a soda bit, but we're happy to be here tonight. Leon Edwards approached him, and he got a meal that he was not expecting. Oh. Let me tell you something, man. When you're in the arena, when you're in the O2 Arena, you better be ready to fight backstage or inside the octagon. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. Well, you're starting to see the damage now bleeding from his cheek. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Landed that punch flush. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Nice job with that follow-up shot as well. Real sneaky body kick. Again, going back to the jab, just out of range. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. That right hand landed. Ooh, what a punch. Bone on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's gonna put him to sleep. Big leg kick lands. Back and forth we go here. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, blocks the shot. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh! Oh! Massive kick to the body. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. Choi's kick is blocked. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. I mean, he's cutting him down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. And both guys really throwing with authority. Really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Punch over the top. Oh, wow, those leg kicks are already taking effect. Decent right hook attempt, but it's no good. Can't take many of those, you better check. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. And they separate. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right. I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Good stick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. 
Oh, nice straight there. I guess that's the quickest way to the target, right? Just throw straight. Straight down is always best. Round two straight ahead. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there and he's not on his toes and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next Ready? round. A high Ready? number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Nice straight punch. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Straight counter, goodbye, short. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Dig and kick. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high. Blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Go, 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 go. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. He lands a knee there. Nice deception there to get that knee to the target. Really good knee. Nice job of driving it right to the target. Getting it to land exactly where you want it to. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Moving to his left now. Ooh, big shot land. Now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, if you end the night, that one landed right on the spot. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Ooh-wee! Ooh-wee, what a right hand by this young man. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. So he counters with an effective punch there, and at least in that situation, it paid to have the advantage in reach. Straight right, he misses. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Straight punch lands. Big leg kick lands. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Yeah, left hook found its target. Visibly limping here. Instead, a swing and a miss by the Korean Super Bowl. Trying to double up on that jab. 
All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking. He's rolling. He's slipping. He's doing a great job. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you got to like the output on display here. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, a lot of high-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it, if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body. They're really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Just missing on the high kick there. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Beautiful punch. Whiffs on the straight right hand. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, the cut on that cheek is only getting worse. His face is a mess. Wow, nice slip and an even better rip. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Leg kick. Good punch, Lance. Just misses there with the left. Looks like his leg is hurt from limping a little bit. Just over three minutes to go. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony, Always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Good punch. Nice leg kick land. And he landed the right hand there. Spinning back fist is there. Big kick land. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent start to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Flush right hand is true. Beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming or he will batter and bruise you with that single strike. Nice head kick. Signs of bruising now on that left thigh. Oh, oh. big knee. Oh, right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. The Korean Superboy gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Barely missed on an uppercut right here on the inside. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. 
beautiful body kick. Effective strike there by Short. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to knock gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice. Goes to the body with the knee. Keep your hands up. Oh, that's on the feet. His opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was Cain Velasquez's punch of choice. Every time he landed that overhand right, he hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly again. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. A lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, DC, here we go with our next round, and we'll see if he can pick up where he left off. High volume of strikes landed in the previous round. High volume of strikes landed. He was able to be accurate, but also very, very active in his approach to the start of this fight. Oh, blocks that kick to the body. Nicely done. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Nice punch by Choi. Leg kick. Choi's cut is only getting worse, making a nice donation to the canvas tonight. Wow, what a kick! Nice body kick. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. The knee is blocked there. Nice defense by the Korean Super Bowl. Leg is hurt here, you can see that. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Nice punch lands over the top. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Beautiful body keep lands right under the elbow. And a miss with the right hook. It's such a fast leg kick. Big punch lands through the middle. Oh, man, it ain't Dikembe Mutombo, but he is blocking all these shots coming man, this way. Man, get that out of here. He sees it coming. You're going to have to mix it up. Shake that finger. Shake that finger. The Korean Superboy gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Three, two, three. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. So turning defense into offense there as he counters with a jab to the head. He's got the reach advantage, and it certainly paid there. Punch coming. It's blocked. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing it. He doesn't have any tell when he's going to throw a knee. Nice punch there by Choi. 90 seconds now to go in this one. 
Oh, and that kick is blocked. Well, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by Choi. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting him. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finishes. A big, massive hook. He's out! Wow! Wow! What a fight! You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. And there he is after the huge...